All right, what's up, guys? I'm here with Lennox and Cole, and they're going to be debating who's coming out of the AFC and who's coming out of the NFC this year in for the Super Bowl. All right, um, I'm going to start with the NFC. I believe that a little bit of an underdog. I like the 49ers this year. They have a full squad. The only wild card is the quarterback, Trey Lance, but I uh, have a lot of confidence in him. I think with his supporting cast, they can also lean on the run game for a good portion of the season where they don't have to put it all on him. They can also run those jet sweeps with Debo Samuel. That's really good. They have a top-notch offensive line. They have very good receivers like Brandon Ayuk. Jawan Jennings emerged last season. George Kittle, the tight end, is George Kittle. And their defense is one of the best in the league. I feel pretty confident in them. Now, there are a lot of other good NFC teams, but I like the Niners. Yeah, I feel like if Trey Lance is good, then... Forty Niners have a pretty good chance out of the yeah. NFC. All right, what do you think, Linux? Yeah, um, that's this is a tough one here, but I think out of the NFC, it's the uh, the Bengals are coming back out. I mean, they had a great season last year. They couldn't get over the hump in the Super Bowl, but I still think they go into the Super Bowl next year with all their great talent. And I mean, they didn't make that many moves this off season. They still have their great quarterback, Jamar Chase, great wide receiver. So I think they're gonna be coming out this year. You think that they're better than Deshaun Watson and his Browns? You think if he plays, you still think that they're better? Yeah, I mean, they they're just they are better because they have they don't have that much experience, but they have more experience than the Browns and Deshaun Watson. Uh, we can't right. we can't leave out the Bills for the AFC. The Bills have Josh Allen and Stephon Diggs. Me, I think that they lost on a coin toss. I don't even really like. Yeah, if, if they get the wall, if they win that coin toss, I think I think we're talking about. The Bills won in the championship this year. So, I got the Bills at a dark heart. I still think the Bills are a little bit too talk, too much talked about. Um, I think I think there are better teams. I personally think the Browns are going to be pretty good if Deshaun can get on the field. I mean, that, that roster is kind of stacked with Kareem Hunt, Nick Chubb, Deshaun Watson, and wide receiver. They have Anthony Peoples-Jones. They have somebody who I'm blanking on right now. Amari Cooper. You got Amari Cooper. I forgot about Amari Cooper. They have solid tight end. Uh, Austin Cooper is pretty good if he gets he, if he can stay healthy in their D. Miles Garrett is a beast. Um, they have pretty good secondary. John Johnson the third, the former Ram. Troy Hill, former Ram. Um, they have some they have some good players there. All right, it looks like we got a question coming out of the audience. Audience, so Surf, what do you have to say? Um, I'm just uh, asking about how do you think the Lions are going to do this year? Do you think they're going to take a step forward from last year? Yeah, I do. I actually, I, I think they're going to win seven or eight games. I think they're going to be somewhat competitive until like the last three, four weeks of the season before they start to drop off. But I think they'll win a few games. They'll make some games tight with the Vikings and the Packers in that division. Yeah, I forgot who I saw. I think his last name was St. Brown. Amon Ross St. Brown. Yes, yes. He he looked okay. I, I liked him. Um, He's last, pretty good the end of last season. The end of last season. So, yeah, he started yeah I think well. they have some good potential. Yeah, I think they'll it. move up. I know. If, even if they get to the wild card, they won't win. I know they will step, take a step forward, so they will they will get better over time. But, um, yeah, I think this team has a pretty bright future in the league. That's good for the TV show. Uh, thank you for watching, and see you later. Thank you.